StarCraft made me a computer expert. I was so fr frustrated to run this game on a Pentium processor, Intel Pentium processor during my high school days. So it was one of the most influential game during that time. StarCraft is a game of strategy all about Terran, Protoss, and uh, Zerg. So they are the three races that are competing with each other through strategy of the human that's controlling the race. It's like building your base from basic, gathering resources, the gas and the minerals, the crystals. It's a war competing against eight players with different races. My favorite was the Protoss because I like the the one, the river. It's a very damaging character. The river and in the Zerg, the lurker, which borrow himself under the ground. And for the Terran, it's the siege tank. So those are the most uh, important characters in my computer skills. Yeah, I became so frustrated about building my own computer in my old computer that was my purchase by my dad running on windows 95 couldn't run the game because of lacking resources with that game i became fame uh popular with the uh, psu the power supply unit or the heart of your computer the motherboard which all of your cpu ram are connected and the hard drives the CPU, which is the brain of your computer, the processing power, the RAM, the random access memory, usually the temporary memory, and the last is the hard drive. So those are the five components of a computer. During that time, the GPU or the video card was already introduced, in which StarCraft game needs a video card to run that. But previous generation of Intel Pentium don't need a video card to run. That became influential that I need to learn and study the computer. From that, I became, I operate the Windows 95, tweak its settings on what missing file DDL couldn't run on the StarCraft. Uh, StarCraft was CD-ROM based and also CD-ROM was so famous during that time that it is so expensive for the StarCraft CD to run. Uh, the drive cost around 3,000 to 4,000 pesos. Just the drive and the StarCraft game also cost that much. It became my frustration and my inspiration to improve further my skills about computer. Not only on programming, but also on the hardware part. When you go to the OS, the kernel, the OS installation, the antivirus, all the running. Yeah, that's the challenge part because integrating all the software and hardware make it run. There are so many incompatibilities of the hardware during that time because not all the vendors are synchronized. Yep. So, yeah, it became my frustration that the StarCraft. So, Guys, if you still know how to play StarCraft, let's play again. Broad War was the number one. And also the Quake. Yep. And speaking about computer, uh, you also need, when you want to learn something or you get, you want to be an expert, you need to learn everything about that. And you need to study from hardware to software. So with that experience, I became a... I, I, started to install a OS from a computer and building computer parts from scratch like integration I used to go to the <clears throat> thinking tools uh, to this is not a sponsor video to buy my computer parts and yep and because of that expensive uh, PC parts during that time and we couldn't afford an upgrade just for a gaming PC. We opted to go to the internet cafe just to play for around 30 pesos per hour during that time. It was an ex ah, no, not 30, but 
50 to 40 pesos per hour because computer was expensive during that time and it came the prices became lower and lower from the time it is already computer parts are booming <coughs> so yeah the starcraft made me uh, build my own pc and craft it that it can run so moving forward yes the we started to buy a new pc it was a pinchum 4 with a hyper threading technology then the starcraft would run easily and the video card was already installed using a eight uh, four gigabit of ram and hard drive yep it was a blaze and after that another game was introduced from starcraft we go to the what you call that warcraft it's a warcraft it's a more intensive and more hardware demanding game from starcraft so that's how i evolved so nowadays i don't just play games but i build pc for uh, content and video editing so that's how i got my pc skills from a game it made me build something then make me believe that something is really attainable if you just want it and want to learn about it okay so that's how starcraft was very influential during the time if you like this kind of video if you're relatable about starcraft and building a pc and what game was your inspiration to become a computer expert yeah, for me it's a starcraft so and also during that time it, it was starcraft from blizzard warcraft delta force quake and counter strike yep those are the games during that time that stands in my mind and also it develops a lot of my skills so using leveraging your inspiration to develop further your skills to become an expert